What's going on guys, Lifty Gonzalez here, back with another Pogo video, and in today's video guys, we are talking about two topics today, and of course, topic number one, we are talking about the current Solstice Horizons event that is taking place in the game right now. Do remember, this event does feature daytime spawns, and also features nighttime spawns as well, but there has been a lot of confusion as to when nighttime spawns do appear in the game because some people would open up the game at 9 p.m. local time or 10 p.m. local time and they would still have of course daytime spawns such as you know soul rock ladybug cottony on their game when of course it should be nighttime spawns when it's 9 p.m. or 10 p.m. local time they should of course be seeing like the spinner rack and the lunatones instead but of, again they are of course still getting daytime spawns even at that time frame so it was found out that what they were doing initially was the nighttime spawns would get activated two hours after your local sun set so again it was not like one specific given time as to when nighttime spawns would be activated it would be of course in your local area as soon as the sun sets two hours after that you would of course be getting nighttime spawns now for some people this would be around like midnight local time as to when the nighttime spawns would start spawning in their game which uh you know you probably shouldn't go out there at midnight 1 a.m local time to catch these pokemon probably not the best idea uh in your area so a lot of people were asking pogo to of course make the nighttime spawns appear a little bit earlier and they did listen they did actually listen guys as we see from this tweet right here from pokemon go hub trainers we are pleased to say that niantic have acknowledged the northern hemisphere nighttime spawn problem also for the south too and have amended nighttime spawns to appear 6 p.m to 6 a.m local time everywhere in the world for the rest of the event so we have about four days left of the event so again nighttime spawns 6 p.m to 6 a.m much better time frame if you guys are looking for you know a shiny lunatone shiny spinner rack or if you want to catch some fan hump as well you guys can of course get these spawns starting today at 6 p.m local time so definitely a w update right there so again very very happy about that so let me know in the comments below guys if you do start actually seeing the nighttime spawns such as lunatone at 6 p.m local time in your area please let me know below in the comments now for topic number two of today's video guys we are talking about how to catch carbink in pogo the gen 6 jewel pokemon yes it is now available to catch in the game so how do you get this pokemon well this pokemon is available in research and more specifically timed research so it will be in your today view not in the special research with professor willow or whatever this will be in today view a timed research now the question is how do you unlock the time research because for my account i don't have this time research well i have an answer for you guys you have to of course buy the global go fest ticket in order to unlock this time research now you're not in any hurry as of yet you have about two weeks to get this because on july 5th you have to buy the ticket before july 5th to unlock this research so you have to go into your shop and of course locate the global go fest ticket i think it's about 15 us dollars so as soon after you guys buy that ticket in the shop you should have that time research unlocked on your game it may require you guys to restart the app but after restarting the app you guys should go to the today view and you should see that time research right there for carbink and the, and the research is called in the rough and these are the steps of the in the rough time research it's pretty easy Play with your buddy five times for one lore. Open five gifts for 10 Ultra Balls. Make 10 great throws for 500 dust. Power up 10 rock or fairy type Pokemon for an Onyx encounter, which is shiny boosted by the way, and catch 25 different species of Pokemon for one lucky egg. After you guys claim all of that, you guys can of course claim an encounter with Carbink and also three silver pineapple berries and 3000 XP as well. And that's it. Boom, we get a brand new Gen 6 Pokedex entry 
right there after doing that easy research so that is the only way currently to get carbink and pogo you do have to buy the global go fest ticket before july 5th so again make sure you guys check out the shop see how much the ticket is if you guys have enough to buy it buy it and of course get an encounter with carbink a brand new pokedex entry for your pogo account so let me know in the comment section below guys have you caught carbink yet in pogo or do you plan to before july 5th let me know thank you guys so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed drop a like in the video subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next one peace